Hey everybody, it's PJ and Jade, and we're with the puppies, but I want to have a discussion about why we are feeding the puppies goat milk, okay? A lot of people appear to be freaking out over the fact that the puppies are getting goat milk, and so I just wanted a, um, a video that I could point to to explain it. So our comfort level is that the puppies grow between 5 and 15% a day. Okay, like every day. That's where we want them to be, between 5 and 15%. So this is, we weigh them in grams. Now, what you have to understand is there's a lot of variation in the day based on when Lacey fed them, you know, was, is, is, are we weighing them before and after, how close to exactly 24 hours. Some days are going to be longer, some days are going to be shorter. So there's always going to be some variation. Um, so you don't like freak out if you have one small day um, and whatnot. But these are, so this is Chandler. And Chandler's um, birth weights, as you can see, started out higher and then they've gotten lower. Now, this is a percentage. So obviously, they're smaller here, right? So the same weight gains is going to produce um, a higher percentage, right? Because the bigger they get, the more they have to weigh to get such a big percentage. So you, you expect it to go down over time as the puppies get bigger, right? They can't can't sustain, and you don't want them to sustain a, you know, a, a <laughs> this one is 20%, but that one's 20% because that one was only 7%. So obviously it was a, a little bit, um, a little bit different, but, um, what we're seeing and what we've been seeing is these numbers are starting to drop below our 5% that we like to see. And so what that tells us is a couple of things. Um, number one and most important is that, uh, their, their, um, weights are not where we want. You can switch to, um, Phoebe. So here's Phoebe. You can see Phoebe's had a couple days in the 2%. Here she's at 1%, but that was probably because that um, the 7% was taken later on the day. So that's Phoebe. Where's Joey? Um, Joey's had the had that real small one there, but surrounded by the bigger ones. This is Monica. Uh, Monica's had two at 2%. And then Rachel has a 2%. She had a real small one here, but again, it's probably because of that 11% one. It was just the time of day um, that did that. And then we look at their um, overall weight gain. So they have all quadrupled. So now go back. So Rachel's at 4.5 times her birth weight. Monica's at 4.1. Um, Phoebe's is at, no, this is Joey. Joey's at 4.8. Phoebe is at 4.1. And Chandler is at 4.4. So they're all they're all doing great. We're not we're not at all concerned about this. But as we see this number start to drop, what we know is that most moms will start to wean their puppies around three to four weeks. Now, weaning is not a, a faucet. It's not they they just completely stop. It's that the puppies start to get their teeth. Um, you know, it starts to become more um, uncomfortable for mom. As the puppies are getting bigger and bigger, you know, mom only has so much milk supply. So she will naturally start to wean them around the three to four week mark. And then, you know, usually finish up around seven to eight weeks is, is typical, especially for the larger breeds. Um, most large litters and, you know, with good size, they need to be supplemented. So um, we are introducing the puppies to goat milk that they will learn to lap. That's number one. And then we will start to put raw meat in there and smush it all up. It's a really gross job. Jade gets to do it, um, <laughs> which she's really excited about. But um, that's, uh, that's how we work on it. So no, no panicking is necessary. We've not pulled Lacey away. We're not denying Lacey the ability to be with her puppies or, or do this. There's no profit mongering in all of this. This is all about just what is natural for, um, for puppies. It is a natural process, just like human women, right? We, you know, they start to introduce baby food and solid food, you know, around some as, as young as two months, some three, four, five, six, whatever it is. But it depends on, on the baby. It depends on mom and her milk supply. It depends on a lot of factors. Um, the same thing is with the puppies. So they are, they are learning 
um, how to drink that. It is not their main source of nourishment um, by any means, but uh, that is the process. And they're doing really well. I think Monica definitely has, has figured it out uh, the best. Um, and so, uh, but everybody else is, is, is really getting the hang of it. Um, and so we're just doing that once a day. Uh, I don't know when exactly we'll introduce, um, you really shouldn't put your weight on that like that. Um, I don't know when exactly we will introduce the, uh, raw meat that depends on, um, that depends on the puppies. Um, not this week. It probably won't be until next week at the earliest. Um, but we'll see how they do. We'll be watching their, continuing to watch their weight gain. A lot of people mix in with the milk. They mix in, um, oatmeal, um, oats, thing, you know, things like that. Um, I choosing not to, I'm not, if that, if that works for people, it's, that's absolutely great. Um, but we're choosing not to, we're choosing to avoid the grain and to start with the meat. Um, so that is, uh, that is what, what we're doing with that. Um, so that's what's going on with the weaning. There's again no need to freak out. We are not <laughs> we are not denying the puppies, Lacey. We are not de denying Lacey. Um, the the puppies. It's 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 all good. All good. Hey. Hi. Can you, on? Uh, you can put the lights on. Hey babies. So Jade has to actually go get goat milk for the day. We just no, finished. Are you done? Are you good? Put milk in there. Oh. Warming up right now. Okay. <laughs> um, don't get mad at Lacey. Graydon will fix it. Okay. <laughs> Lacey may or may not have damaged the wall. <laughs> hey, poppers. You want one? Oh, you know I want one. Which one do you want first? You want to go in order? Since I was just quoting Chandler, David Chandler. Ugh. They're so heavy. They're pudgy. Oh, pudge ball. Um, so I was looking at, this is, for those of you who missed it yesterday, their, their, um, their weaning pen, their play pen is now I open. Want to grab the banana. Uh, yeah, and they are... Um, climbing into here all on their own as you can tell because they pooped this is their where they're supposed to learn to poop and I had saw some evidence of pooping going on in here so so we'll see how quickly it takes them to learn to do that <laughs> just hanging his feet <laughs> what? I'm fully supporting I know you are yeah. Chandler <laughs> coat is getting very thick already yeah it's it's definitely changing it's it's not coarse but it's more real it's, it's more dense yeah it's, it's not a puppy fluff anymore now it's like oh there's a whole other layer coming in um so their mom these guys are a crossbreed their mom is a great pyrenees um remember which one's phoebe the fat one. Wait, <laughs> that one fat. actually i think joey's past her now um, Look they're kind of fighting back and forth, but today, wanders. they're still, I know they walk. Joey was walking full on his feet. I was surprised. Oh, um, yeah, that's Phoebe. Hi. Uh, hello, 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 hello. She's like, <laughs> I don't want to be picked up. Um, I'm alone. Hello. Hello. So anyway, so their mom is a great Pyrenees, Lacey, um, and their dad is a Bernese mountain dog called, Hi. named Castle, and they, um, hello. are... Uh, mixed breed that's commonly referred to as a great Bernese. Um, I have also been asked why I am quote breeding mutts and I am not breeding mutts. I am intentionally cross breeding. Um, I personally feel that um, there, so there is a place for that. Um, and I love both breeds and I am in crossbreeding. I am giving them what's called hybrid vigor. Isn't he such a good this walker? One? Uh, that's Monica. Oh, hello, Monica. I understand you're developing quite a personality. Yeah, I really, Monica's really uh, growing on me. I know. I'm getting licked over here. Um, 
love her face. She's like, mm. So we did it intentionally um, to help take the wander out of the Great Pyrenees and lengthen the life of the, um, of the, uh, of the Bernese. Like, so that's why we did that. Nah, I was like, they like each other's butts. Yeah, and Lacey likes these, and I've seen what Lacey likes, so no. Yeah, okay. Get Joey your feet under you. Or Rachel. You still have Joey and Rachel. Mm -hmm. It's Rachel. Yeah, come here, Rachel. I, I know you're all comfortable, Joey. right? So you'd really rather not be doing this, but here I am, so <sighs> deal with it. <sighs> Oof. Joey's biting me. Uh, we're not giving them water yet. Hello, Rachel. No water yet. Um, I have not felt their teeth come through yet, but they're definitely getting closer. Don says, do you raw feed your adult dogs? We do, but not exclusively. Um, we have too many, and... Uh, um, but we do raw feed them, but not exclusively. Excuse me. <laughs> okay, fine. You go back down. <clears throat> Who's Joey? Here, Joey, go. Well, so. I'm That's what I figured. <laughs> there you go. Joey's yeah, my favorite, so. Uh, you the one. <clears throat> <clears throat> I know, I don't really yeah, have a I'm gonna not get that shot because it's a nice butt shot of Joey. <laughs> Fighting dogs. Mom, she just got over here in like three seconds. She was fast. You should have seen him when I was trying to get Lacey to feed him, and Lacey was just hopping back and forth. Every time she would sit down, I would get her to sit down. Puppies would come, and then she would get up and walk away. But she, they, they were climbing over this like. Double time, because Lacey kept walking around. Are they all five pounds? Um, are, are they all over? Hold on, let me do the math. Um, no, I am not going to keep them. Um, yes, that's a better shot of Joey. They've been enjoying upside down more. They didn't like it there for a while, and they've been. Yeah, mom. It's they've like, been snuggling. It's like eighteen and like. 18. 18 is 18. That's 4. Mm. So 2350 is 5. Yeah. That's why I said. Are they all over 2300? No. Okay. Some of them are, though. So some of them are over 5. Some of them are just under 5. Um, yeah, they're all over 4. But Rachel and mm. Chandler. That's enough man time for you. Actually, the only one above 5 is Joey. Phoebe is Phoebe is 2442, so she's like right there, but not yet. Wait, say it again, I wasn't listening. Phoebe is 2442. Joey's the only one who's above five. Twenty-three is five. Oh, twenty-three is five? Yeah. In that case then it is just Phoebe and Joey. No. Now I'm doing the math wrong. Twenty-two. Mom, it's tw I know, and now you got number. I'm, I'm twenty-two. Four fifty is times two is nine. Nine and nine is eighteen. Eighteen plus four fifty is twenty two. So twenty two fifty. I'm not counting the extra four. I'm not okay. counting the extra four. Okay, so how much is it? Twenty two fifty? Yeah. Plus five times four, so technically twenty two seventy. Twenty two seventy. Well then Monica Joe would be. Chandler's twenty two forty four and Rachel is twenty one sixty five. So they're almost all over five pounds. Uh, when they are fully grown, they'll weigh roughly between 70 and 100. Yeah, you guys got a lot of way to go. Uh, <laughs> Beckett, then you don't. Oh, Beckett was like, oh, was a big fluffy, yawn. Fluffy. She's like, I'm 70 pounds and like two months old. Right, Monica? Yeah, we need to <clears throat> use this space for admin. <laughs> well, they gotta, they're going to all have toys at some point hanging down from them. <laughs> Jim, Jim, ever the marketer at heart, Jim wants to put goat milk stuff all across the sides of there. <laughs> the occasional coupon code for, for those of you who are paying close attention. <laughs> Just slip it in there. Hi, little one. Hi, goat milk stuff code. Okay, well, I'm going to stop you guys.
You did well, honey. Thank you. Look how sturdy he is on his paws. Mom, that's Chandler. It's pretty good. He's going to climb over? Come on, Monica. Show everybody what you can do. Yay! Did you see Joey barking? Mm-hmm. you Monica found me. Graydon will fix it, don't worry. Um, Melly says, do the boys always weigh more than the girls, or depends? It really depends. Um, typically, though, um, typically, they the boys pass the girls, but not always. Monica is going to town, licking my wrist. Does that taste good? Does that taste good? I don't know if I can swap the camera. Nope, I couldn't do it. I couldn't do it. I can't show them what you were doing. <laughs> um, okay, so uh, the other thing everybody's always freaking about is Phoebe's back legs. If Phoebe is is the is one of the bigger ones she is um still none of them are 100 percent on their feet yet so no i am not freaking out about phoebe's back legs um it's it's something that she gets up on her feet she when she's up on her feet she walks just fine so no i don't i'm not worried about that either okay that's that's a cute picture right there they love resting their heads on there why are we so cute? Are you gonna try and climb <laughs> over, Chandler? And Chandler made it. Chandler made it more gracefully than Monica. Monica just flopped. Hey, bud. Hey, buddy. Well, I'm going to go. We're going to feed these guys the goat milk, which is a messy, a messy job. What was that sound? He's playing with the mic. Okay, you guys, I'll take care, and we'll talk to you soon. Bye, guys.